हेलो फ्रेंड्स टुडे आई एम कम अप विद अ वेरी इंटरेस्टिंग फॉर्मूला इन एक्सेल वेयर सपोज आई हैव दिस फोल्डर इन विच आई हैव मल्टीपल इनवॉइसेस दीज आर सम इनवॉइसेस एंड माय सीनियर हैज आस्क्ड मी टू गिव दिस इनवॉइसेस लिस्ट इन द एक्सेल लाइक सपोज आई हैव टू टाइप दिस 1290900061 Six two. I have to maintain the list of all these invoices which are in the saved in this PDF form. I have to prepare this in Excel. So this thing I can just convert this list into Excel within just few click by the use of Power Query in Excel. Just wait. How will we do that? Suppose these are the folder which I have some multiple invoices and I require this in Excel. So just open this Excel. And then go to the data tab, and there go get data. So I required this data from the file and this from folder. Just click on the folder. And my folder is saved in the desktop with the invoices list. I just don't ah uh, go in inside the option. Just select that folder and then click open. now it will open your power query editor now it is showing that they have selected the file now what i have to do i have to just now transform data just click on the transform data now my power query editor is open where i can edit whatever i required so it is showing me the list of all the content name data sets but i required only this name so just click the name option and then right click and then select the option remove other column so all the other column get removed i get the invoice number now in addition to the invoice number i get the file extension so i also don't require this file extension in my main excel just select the file and then go to split column and the first option by delimiter then click okay now it has custom by default select that here the delimiter is dot so it has selected that how we can select anything here here is a custom select dot here because there is a dot i want to separate after every dot there is a pdf so it will see the dot and then each across a delimiter it will split this column so just click okay now see my this invoice number changes to a pdf is removed so i just again right click on that and remove other column now i get all the invoices list just go to close and load now see the magic all these invoices if i just short form it now these all invoices are now in my excel file one more magic suppose i add some new invoices here it will automatically update here because it's a power query suppose i'm just wait i just add some invoices here i will change the name of this invoice number i will change to 4 5 and 6 so these three invoices i copy paste and add in my invoices list now three invoices more are added i will just show you now see my data is available only till 253 i have added three more invoices now again i have to type it but because we have used power query which is dynamic i have to just refresh it it will go in this invoice list and whatever invoices which are being added it will be added here just go to data tab and go to refresh all as soon as refresh is you see all the three invoices has been added 54 55 56 so by this way you can easily get the list of invoices from this hope you like this video thanks
So there's recording going on, but who are you? 